get so to y'all this big boss so look check this out i had a subscriber ask me which fragrance is better when it comes to valentino womo born and roma or valentino womo's coral fantasy i actually love both of these fragrances okay so i can understand like if you was in a store and you had somebody trying to sell you both which one would you get all right because as y'all know valentino is getting very 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 popular with their fragrances okay so y'all want to make sure y'all get the best one because at the end of the day money don't grow on trees so i'd rather tell y'all about the best valentino that came out but you know when it comes to this channel you want the best okay so i'm gonna give y'all the best so stay right there don't go nowhere let's get into it I'm a money magnet, draped in designer, I stay high fashion, tissue bougie, no I'm high maintenance. Alright, before you get into this video, I will have to shout out the sponsor, it's called Buy Me A Coffee, okay? Buy Me A Coffee is another way for you to support your YouTube creators, okay, like me. Any support y'all throw my way is great, I love y'all, and you know I make these videos whether y'all support me or not, alright, so it's just honestly optional, just up to you. All right, now let's get into this video. All right, so let's talk about these colognes real quick. All right, so Valentino, I love Valentino. The only Valentino I don't got is the Valentino One More Intense. I don't have that yet, I heard that smells great. I'm gonna pick it up though, because you know, these are toilets. Cause this is the Curl Fantasy, this is the Born Aroma these toilets i need something that's really strong so i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna get the one more intent soon so when y'all see it we're gonna do a whole good little like some little verses you know what i'm saying but i really don't like the little dreamer the yellow dream whatever i hate that so i'm not buying that for y'all so i don't care what y'all say i'll probably just get the sample so i can do it before you buy to like scare y'all away from it so y'all won't buy it but i do not like the yellow dream and i remember when i was in dillard's that lady was really trying to sell me it i'm like girl it don't smell good and i had to ask her like do you even like it? She's like, well, it's not something I can, uh, I'll get for myself. So I'm like, why is you really selling it? And to come to find out, she works for Valentino, so she just gotta sell what she sell. I'm like, we well, might as well just sell the best one. Why are you selling this weak ass one? But I guess they had a whole bunch of bottles left over, and they were just trying to get rid of them. And I was like, but that's, you gotta take that up with Valentino. Then you gotta tell them to stop making these bottles. Then or just like give them away for free, or do a bogo sale. Like I'll get Yellow Dreamer if. I can get like a Valentino fragrance and then get that for like half off, like a BOGO deal. That's the only time I'm getting Yellow Dreamer. If I gotta pay full price, I ain't getting it. I don't care. All right, though, let's talk about these two fragrances right here, okay? When it comes to the Born and Roma, I can honestly say that this was my favorite Valentino for a long time. Like when I smelled this, I just knew like, oh my God, Valentino got something up their sleeve. They are underrated. I really like this fragrance, okay? Because it had that mir mineral note. It's like a mineral, uh, fresh, sweet, sexy fragrance, okay? But it's not like sweet, like a like a gourmand, cakey sweet. It's sweet like a, it's so fresh. It's uh, like he throw a hint of sugar on that, like sugar water or something, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like fresh like that, okay? But when they came out with Curl Fantasy, they took that same fresh, a tad bit sweet and threw some apple in there, you know what I'm saying? Some apple notes, some actual sweet fruit in that, you know what I'm saying? So I was just like, damn, Coral Fantasy smells great. Wow, but they smell so similar. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, they smell very similar. So what I can say, if you like something that's more on a fruity, fresh side, then grab Coral Fantasy. But if you just like super fresh, great for the summers and springtime, you wanna grab Born Aroma. In my opinion, y'all know I love sweet fragrances because in my head, I just kind of feel like just because it got that little sweetness, it's gonna last longer, you know what I'm saying, than like something that's super fresh. So I really love Coral Fantasy. Like I just, I go nuts over this. I love this, you got me a lot of compliments. Now I'm not saying this, don't give me compliments, but sometimes I'll have to layer this with like another sweeter fragrances just for people to really appreciate the Valentino that's in this, okay? But with this by itself, now nah, look, now let me tell y'all, I'm gonna tell you a little trick. Now, this smell good, right? But the my favorite scent to layer this with it don't even need to be layered. It still smell good by itself, but where is that? If y'all layer Curl Fantasy with Versace Dell and Blue, I'm trying to tell y'all you have a mega 
juggernaut like combination. All right. You said what? Huh? Yeah, this combo right here. <sighs> like if I was going to do something, I'll empty this into this and put it in a big bottle and just be like, because this right here smells crazy. Pino, what's up, man? Come here. Look at Pino, man. She just want to talk to me all morning knowing I'm doing my video. What you want, girl? What you want? What? I don't care about that. Give me a kiss. Mwah, 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 mwah. my shirt. Look, look at the camera, man. Tell him, hey. <laughs> she crazy. All right, but to wrap up this video, I'll have to say that Curl Fantasy is the best Valentino one more, okay? If you like this video, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I'm Big Boss, and I'm out. Bitch, I'm Big Boss, I'm a threat. Bitch, nigga, pipe down for our flex. I'ma put a whole lot of money on your dreads. Like a bowling ball, I put a hole in your head. Shit that you rap in your songs, I'll be live.